Hi, I'm four-time world champion Rocky Carson, and today we're going over footwork. Our first example is going to be on the serve, and the wrong way to get out of the box. If you notice, as I get out of the box, not only is my back facing the back wall, but it's also facing my opponent and the ball. And lastly, I'm also on my heels. Now let's go over the right way. Having proper footwork will give us awareness of three things. First, the ball. Second, our opponent. And lastly, ourselves. Rather than backstepping, I'm now opening my stands and shuffling back to the middle of the court in a much better ready position. Now let's move into our forehand approach. Notice how I give myself space, keeping my chest open towards the ball until I finally approach and attack it. On this close-up, as I'm shuffling back, my feet are never crossing. Now to simplify these steps, you'll notice how I'm never crossing my feet, but shuffling and pivoting throughout my approach. Now let's move to the backhand. Notice how I keep my chest open towards the ball until I'm getting in position to attack. Now you'll notice on these examples I'm giving myself a lot of space to the ball and lastly stepping to the ball which allows me to now stay in my shot and not fall backwards. But spacing is a big key. Now lastly, let's go over some footwork drills. These drills will allow you to focus on the basic fundamentals, yet also help you with your speed. In this drill, you'll notice I'm reaching from the front service line to the encroachment line always rotating with the opposite hand to touch the line. But notice, I'm never crossing my feet and I'm staying low the whole time. On this one, now I'm pivoting and rotating across as if I was getting ready to attack the ball. Remember, if we have proper footwork, we should be pivoting and shuffling throughout the court almost all the time. These are the little fundamentals that will allow you to become a much better player.